in. Good boy. Good job, sir. Yeah, Mikey, Mikey, Mikey. Good boy. You do. Well done. <laughs> Lewis. Good boy, buddy. <laughs> You're number one in our hearts, Laura. We are so <laughs> Love your eyelashes. What kind of mascara is that? <laughs> There's mom and dad. <laughs> I heard that she was ordering her mom and dad around saying, You do this, you do that. Do that. <laughs> nice looking dog, he's there. I do love your mascara. I just love it. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> now, this was your first run. Was it everything you expected it was ever going to be? It was even better. The trails were good? Yeah, trails were beautiful. Um, the sceneries, everything. Yeah, incredible. Yeah. Will you come back again? Oh, yeah. We'll be back next year. What do you think of the jambalaya? You probably don't get too much of that down in Minnesota, <laughs> do you? <laughs> no, not much at all. Yeah, it was... The first couple crossings were like, what in the world? How do I do this? And then, by the end, I was having fun. And I'd celebrate when I saw a crossing coming up. Yeah. One of the uh, Norwegians or Swedish guys yesterday, I can't remember which one it was, said he was kind of like dancing. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but you know, they'd still rather take those those hills out of the um, Clinton Creek up to the top of the world before Dawson then take the jumbo ice because you ran into a storm up there and then all of a sudden out of the blizzard you found this little musher huddled there saying oh Laura, Laura <laughs> could, could you help me get to Dawson? He said sure, hit your ride. <laughs> Andy owes you a couple of beers and you're 19 and you're legal in the Yukon by the way. <laughs> so make him hold you up to that promise, okay? <laughs> I'll buy you a beer myself. <laughs> So that was, that was a lot of deep snow and, and low visibility and stuff. Tell us about that night. It was, yeah, it was really, I thought it was fun, um, <laughs> <laughs> but I'm crazy. Um, yeah, it was a real challenge for the dogs because obviously they don't see climbing in Michigan. And um, the, uh, they're used to deep snow, but drifting and the wind was all different. And yeah, it was fun to see see him go through that and learn as we went so well it was pretty warm this year so you can imagine what that would have been like at 30 below mm -hmm. how did you uh deal with the warm temperatures in your dogs and hydrating and everything they they were pretty easy um they would drink a whole like a quart of clear water before every run mm -hmm. so just did that and yeah they did pretty well with it um, any highlights of the trip? That was probably the low light that night. Or maybe for you it was a highlight. I don't know. <laughs> that was one of the highlights. That was my second favorite run. Um, and then the run last night was pretty special. Um, just how long it was. And uh, northern lights, the moon. And yeah, it was pretty. Yeah, we had pretty northern lights here last night too. And there's, well, there's the moon up they there too. Out, the northern lights were out coming in here too. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Anything else you'd like to say to your family or sponsors or anything? Thank you to everybody. Well, welcome to Whitehorse. You are our sunshine. We hope we see you back in this race many more years to come. Thank you. Okay. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my 